Well, how about that then? Uh, you get the victory here. Uh, didn't quite measure up to the record though. So how do you put those things in perspective? Um, well, you know, it's hard to go by yourself. So when I was in Spain or uh, Ireland a month ago, like I had a good group that I was walking with and chasing. So it's, it's totally different when you're, you know, in the front the whole time by yourself. Uh -huh. So, um, yeah, so I, I'm happy, you know, I, I, uh, I did okay, you know, like, uh, it, today was more about sealing it, so like, uh, this should make sure I get the world championship spot mm -hmm. for Oregon, and then, uh, um, so, I, I should be in for the 35, then I can just focus on the 20K, and then, uh, race 35K and I'm on again. And then... You had a, a bit <laughs> of a, uh, reaction, uh, were you kind of holding it in, or what, I mean, the, <laughs> yeah. I mean uh, how much, how do you feel well, um, yeah. Coming to the end, you have to kind of contain yourself there. Yeah, I felt okay. It was just, uh, you know, I was trying to make sure, you know, our, it, it didn't really matter for me, but the A mark for Oman was 249. So uh, <laughs> I was like, you know, really close to that. So I just want to make sure I was under that, just, you know, to have some kind of goal mm -hmm. in the race because my, uh, my A and B plans were, were just to kind of work on, you know, work on pacing and then, uh, do a little tempo inside the race and all the 238 is the American record. Do you think that should come down a lot then? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, I think Nick can approve on that. And uh, I think he's going to go faster uh, later in the year. And I think he's going to, you know, I think he's going to break the American, the, yeah, I think he's going to break the American record again for sure. So Definitely. He just said that he's uh, interested in doing a double in Eugene. Is that doable? Uh, it is theoretically doable because of the gap between the two races. The, the, the but 35 is in the last day. Right, yeah. right. So you have nine days. So in okay. theory, you have the chance to do it. It just depends on, you know, if you do the 20, you still might be tired nine days later. The record is three hours. <laughs> 43 seconds. 343. And 30 seconds better. The New American record holder. It came together. It came together. You pushed it off right now. Did you go? I just need to get this is my first 35 I've never gone I did a marathon when I was younger but this is my first big race I've only ever really done 20 and uh, I just wanted to give this a shot it wasn't a bad day for my first time and I was hoping to dip under three hours it died in that last 5k but you know, it, it's still a record for now, and records are meant to be broken, and we'll see what we can do and what the rest of the field's going to do in the coming time. Well, what if the record in your debut? How special is that for you? I know. I, I this was I, I decided, like, at the end of September to uh, go for the 35. So I didn't, I didn't plan probably far enough out, but this was good. Give me one second. Let's go, Maria! Good job, Mia! Yeah, Maria! Oh God, I get oh. Good shot, girl. Oh. Did you notice when Robin dropped out? Did that have any impact on you as well, far as how you perceive it? I uh, I saw kind of how it was playing out as I after I passed her, and I thought maybe she would go pick it back up. Maybe she'd get like another surge. Um, unfortunately, I did see her kind of stop right before I lapped her, and thought maybe she'd hop back in but you could tell that you know she made a decision and I just hope she's okay and she's feeling okay and I know Robin's a, a warrior man she is she is a very fast girl and she's got some big PB still ahead of her and um, this is just this is just one day I, I don't count her out in anything do you know when you passed her originally I think I was like 15k in maybe yeah. Yeah. that I passed her I'm not specifically she sure. went out hard yeah 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 and I think like we all went out conservative the first lap and then you could see we just kind of all settled into our own paces and our own race plans and it just kind of played out from there longer race than you're known for how was your plan then or how did you feel how, how it progressed for you that way you know I knew that last 5k was gonna hurt uh, it really hurt uh, and I think I felt it more going into the last 10k than I expected but, um, you know, I had great support. My coach Terrence is out here. I've been very lucky to train with uh, Emmanuel Corvera, Selena Lepe, Nick Christie this fall. Um, I've had the whole Golden uh, 
track club like behind me um you know like whenever I go to the track with Terrence and it's just surrounding myself with positivity that no matter what I was going to finish this I didn't care what place it was I was going to finish it I was going to put my first one in and whatever it'll be it'll be yeah no it's yeah. Kind of a rebirth I guess yeah yeah for you. yeah we'll see we'll see we'll see where this leads and you know just kind of had to make up for a, a rough two years. <laughs> it's rough. I mean, my, your mother mentioned COVID, but you've had a lot of training uh, gaps or something? Oh, or? yeah. Like, you know, I think everybody just had their own issues over the years. I mean, COVID obviously put a damper in a lot of things. And well, I switched right. coaches during 2021 right. and from Tim Seaman to, Co to Terrence. And, um, you know, there's always an adjustment period there and just ups and downs of life, right? And, mm -hmm. you know, I think we're all losing loved ones and we're all, you know, there's a lot of stress with COVID and making sure you test negative before, you know, the race and you're just trying to balance it all the best you can and sometimes it works out and sometimes it doesn't and today I was fortunate that it came together pretty nicely. Is 8,000 the most you've ever won? Yeah, I think so. Oh, yeah, 8,000 is the most, yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, what are you going to do with that? <laughs> Pay my bills. <laughs>